One of the most effective models of security is security is a meaningful assurance that you are making progress toward your most important goals. The most powerful attack against security is to change somebody's goals. Attackers frequently manipulate victims to adopt goals that are not in the victim's best interest. Modern sales techniques work so well that they render security meaningless. We are all influenced by marketing. We think we are immune. We think we are making rational decisions. But our goals and decisions are not our own. Everybody is susceptible to information manipulation and bias. We are fooled into wanting product. We are deceived with false choices. We are blinded by illusion. Purchases that change my life should be my decision. It's hard, but I can break free of mar marketing. If I work at it, my choices can serve my best interests. I begin to regain control by making a simple analysis of my needs and requirements. As honestly as I can, I write the answers to these questions. In the simplest terms, what's, what's the problem? Or what is the opportunity? What is the current situation costing me? What is the potential gain? How much am I willing to pay to implement the change? What other important issues could I address if I devoted my resources elsewhere? What are all the alternative ways that the issue could be addressed? How effective is each alternative approach to resolving the issue? How much will each approach cost? What other problems will be created by each approach? What other opportunities will be created by each approach? Working with a skeptical spouse, a parent, or a child can help you with the analysis. After you have finished an analysis, lock it down. Print it out. Create incentive to stick with the analysis. Referring to an analysis will help you regain control. Then, I must fight to control my desires. You have to understand the desires created by exposure to marketing are not really me. I am being manipulated. We all are. It will pass. Stick with the analysis. Frequently, the newest, fanciest stuff is not the best value. The best value is usually found in products and services that are available from multiple independent vendors and suppliers. Reliability is usually produced by boring technologies that have been through multiple iterations of real-world testing and refinement. Reliability is usually produced by companies that have meaningful guarantees and usable return policies. If you test a product, make careful written notes of how it failed, met, or exceeded your requirements, and then do not make an immediate decision. After testing a product, I am at a maximum level of delusion. I cannot make rational decisions until the compulsion is broken. Politely thank the sales creature and tell them you will answer in a few days and be vague. Make no specific commitments. Get out and get away as fast as you can. Breaking a sales delusion is hard. I usually have to do something unrelated to the product to regain my perspective. 
I like to go fishing. Others like to engage in social activity. Charity work is very effective at breaking sales spells. Make no decisions until you remember who you really are. Then, review your analysis before making a decision. Remember, any decision that changes your life needs to be your decision.